Bonjour tout le monde, good. Um, hello everyone, how are you? Uh, Mr. Smithson here and there uh, we have our Tic Tac song which is probably um, one of the most annoying French songs that we learn in Rigolo and it sticks in your head. But there you go, it was important to share the beginning of that song with you because we have been learning about time um, on some of our online lessons. So without further ado, year five, it is lesson four. We've got a bit of a wobbly screen at the moment. Um, lesson four. And uh, we're going to look at numbers today. We're going to look at numbers from 31 all the way up to 60. So it's lovely to see some of the learning that you've been doing. Uh, I've seen some wonderful work displayed on our showcase site. So it'd be nice to see a little bit more of our French work up on that site. So well done um, for those of you who have been getting on with your online learning. So I uh, hope you're all staying safe. And without further ado, let's wake Rigolo up and see if we can have a look at today's lesson. Okay, so... Um, au revoir, Jake and Polly. Let's move you out of the way. Take your song away. And we're going to look at our numbers now from um, 31 up to 60. Okay, so 31 up to 60, which is just here. Right, so um, I'm going to quickly show you a short story. Um, this will sort of get you back into it. We've got Marine and Polly here. Um, they're at Chateau Rigolo. Um, I just want you to look out for the numbers that uh, appear. We're going to see some bigger numbers today. So um, have a look, watch the clip. This will get you back into Rigolo, and then we'll do a little bit of learning. Here we go. Enjoy. Marine, Polly et Chichi trouvent la machine de Madame Moulin. Allez, les enfants, un peu d'exercice Touchez les pieds. Levez les bras. Un, deux, continuez. Trois. Trente-huit. Trente-neuf. Quarante. Arrêtez. Et maintenant, levez les pieds. Un, deux, continuez. Trois, quatre, cinq, six. Allez, comptez. Quarante-neuf. 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. Continuez, levez les pieds. 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. Allez! Okay, so there we have Madame Moulin being quite uh, quite cruel to the girls there, putting them through their exercises and giving them exercises up to 60 times there. And leve uh, les bras, lift up your arms, touche les pieds, touch your toes, and being very strict with them. So you may recognize some numbers there, and there may also have been some new ones for you to learn. So we're going to have a look at those in a little bit more detail now. So if you've got a pen and paper handy, that would be great. If not, we can um, you can get one for um, the end of the lesson where we've got a couple of fun activities to do. So um, without further ado, let's have a look at our numbers. So we've gone, we're going to start with 31 up to 40. We've already learned 30, which is trent, trent. And let's have a look at 31. 31. Repetez, 31. 31. And what they've done there, they've put 30, which is 30, and then put and one, a un. So 31, 31. So 31 is 30 and one, 31. Let's look at 32. 32. 32. Now you can see they've taken out the a, the and, and you just have 30 and the number two. 32. Répétez, 32. Let's look at 33. 33. 33. 33. 30 and 3. 34. 34. 
Tron 4. Okay, so you can see the pattern for me now. Let's jump up to 39. 39. 39. 39. So all you need to know is 30 is 30, and because you've already learned your numbers 1 to 10, you just put that number after 30 and you've got your number. Now, we come to the end, we've got 40. This is a new number for you. 40. 40. 40. Repete. 40. So it's that ca sound at the beginning. So those are your numbers from 31 to 40. Now we can count from 41 up to 50. And you've probably already worked this out, some of you, in your head. You now know that 40 is 40. So 41 must be... 41. 41. Repete. 41. 40 and 1. 42. 42 is 42. Drop the and and just put 40 and 2 together. 42. Repete. 42. 43. 43. 43. 44. 44. 44. Let's have a look at 47. 47. 47. So again, you can see the pattern forming here. Once you know 40, you can count all the way up to 50. 50 we haven't learned yet. 50 is... 50. 50. 50. And again, if you look at that number, the first four letters of that number make five. 5 is 5. So 50 is 50. Okay, so 50 is 50. And again, numbers from 51 all the way up to 60, it's exactly the same technique. It's a urn for your first one. 51. 51. Repete. 51. 50 and 1. 52 would then be. 52. 52. 53. 53. 54. 54. And all the way up to 60. 60 is the final number we're going to learn today, and 60 is... 60. 60. Repete. 60. Okay, so those are your numbers. Quite straightforward today. We've only, in theory, had to learn trois numbers, three numbers. We've had to learn 40, which is 40, 50, which is 50, and 60, which is 60. And then it's just a case of using your knowledge to put those numbers together um, to make 51, 52, 60, um, 61, you could do 37, etc. So quite straightforward lesson today. Let's see if we can put that into practice with a quick game. Okay, here we've got boff, um, and we've got four boffs actually, quatre boffs. And I, what I want you to do is pick one of those numbers. Um, and I'd like you to shout out at the screen when they're having the race. I want you to shout for your number, but I want to hear you shouting. I'm sat here in Sheffield recording this lesson for you. I want to hear you shouting en français in French. So we've got the pink number at the bottom, Trente Neuf. We've got the green number, Cinquante-trois, 53. We've got the yellow number, 31, trente et And then we've got the, the navy blue, the black number at the top, uh, 42, 42, 42. So pick your number. I think I'm going for 31. Here we go. Good luck. Cheer your boff on. Come on, 31. Come on. Come on, 31. Qui gagne? Oh. C'est quel numéro? C'est quel numéro? So which one won the race? Shout it out at the screen for me. What was the number that won? En français, in French? Numéro 53. Numéro 53. Numéro 53. So that was the winner of the race. Numéro 53. 53. So well done if you turn 53 to win the race. Okay, we haven't got time for another race because I would like to finish with a little bit of um, bingo. And uh, bingo en français in French is uh, called lotto. So if you have a look now at my board, we've got Equip A, which is Team A, 
a quick B, which is team B. You will need um, a pen and paper, pencil and paper for this one. And I want you to choose whether you're going to be team A or team B. And I'd like you to write those down for me. This will practice um, your number writing. So if you're team A, we've got Sankon Katsur. Sankon Katsur, which is 54. We've got Sankon Sank, which is 55. We've got Tront, which is 30. And we've got Sankon Wheat, which is 58. So if you're team A, those would be your numbers. Team B, Tront Deux, 32. Caron Trois, 43. Caron Tayern, 41. And Caron Deux, 42. Okay, so team A, you've got a lot of 50 numbers. Team B, you've got a lot of those 40 numbers. I want you to write those out in French. If it helps you, write the English numbers next to it. This is all about learning those numbers, getting familiar with them. Madame Moulin's going to call the numbers out for us now. I think I'm going to be team B. Okay, so if you've chosen team A, you're competing against me. If you've chosen D team B, we're playing together. Right, here we go. Good luck, everyone. 32. 32. 32. So I want you to cross that one off, put a circle around it on your board. 32. I'm going to mark our board up here now. 32. Okay, 32. 32. 41. 41. 41. So if you've chosen team A, Unlucky, oh, you haven't got that one either. We've got it over on our board. Caron de Eau. Caron de Eau. Team A, I'm sure you're happy with that number that Miss Madame Moulin's picked out. Sankon Quatre. Okay, catching us up, Team A. 42. 42. 42. So mark that one off on your sheet. 42. Team B. My team are doing quite well here. Let's see what the next number is. 58. 58. 58. Yes, Team A, it is on your board. Cross that one off. Let's see the next number. 55. 55. It's getting very close. 55. Team A, you should have crossed the number off. This one here. Okay. It's a one number shootout. Who's going to get the number? We've got Trant. For team A, we've got Caron Trois for team B. Here we go, good luck. 43. As you can see, I'm quite happy. Caron Trois, team B have won that game. Oh my God. Très bien. Okay, fantastic. Well done, everybody. So, a um, little game of lotto there just to finish off and, and hopefully help you with your numbers. Um, there's two worksheets on the website for you to complete, uh, numbers from 31 up to 60. Also, if you want to have, uh, make your own game of uh, lotto, you can do that. You can make your little cards. Um, obviously, write them in French and practice your French numbers. You could play with somebody, a family member at home. Um, that would be nice. And uh, please, you know, tweet me your work, send your work into Spire. Uh, it's nice to see it on the uh, showcase that Miss Higginbottom's doing. If you really want to challenge yourself, you may have a game of lotto from one all the way up to 60. So you could have 60 numbers to choose from. So that would take a little bit of planning, but it would be nice to uh, practice your numbers all the way up to 60. Um, thank you very much for joining in. Hope you're enjoying these lessons. Hope you're learning some um, new French. And uh, please stay safe, and hopefully we'll see you all very, very soon. Au revoir, everyone. Au revoir.